What's up, YouTube? It's your boy Skinny Moose. Your boy Fast Squirrel. And the boy Vinny brought up new gimmicks. So we got our in new intro done, so as you can see. But today we are reviewing a match for Jay Blade. He asked me to review it for him. So it is IWA Deep South, King of the Carnage, live from the same place as Carnage Cup 13, which was um, in McKenzie, Tennessee. Ooh, McKenzie, Tennessee. It's a two out of three. It's a two out of three falls match with uh, Little Sicko and Jay Blade. So the day before, J the day before Jay Blade had to fight Sick Boy and Chewy Martinez at the same time. Ooh. Also, Little Sicko had to go through three rounds. His opponents were John Rare and Brian White in the first round. The second round, which was Carnage Cup, Obey was in the second round. In the third round, it was Necro Butcher. A.K.A. Maga Butcher, Chewy Martinez, and Bryant Woods. That was on the third round. So, for all of you that did not check us, check it out. Here's the update. So, it was Little Sicko versus Jay Blade. Little Sicko comes out first with a beard and a barbed wire board. Jay comes up next. There's light tubes all over the ropes. Okay. And um, there's a ladder over that Jay uses to climb into the ring. So, it's a two out of three. They start trash talking each other before the match starts. There was supposed to be a third guy. I don't know who the hell the third guy was. Didn't okay. say. Didn't know. At one point early in the match, Jay Irish whips Little Sicko into the corner, and Sicko does a handstand on the turnbuckle. So he goes up, and Little Sicko's like, yes, standing the fuck up on his head. It was pretty cool. And it, there's a lot of good technical wrestling in this match alone. So Sicko does a flying head scissors to Jay, putting him through the glass in the corner. So there was a little sheet of glass. And fucking next thing you know, Little Sicko is doing a flying head scissors and just puts Jay straight through it. Oh, shit. Afterwards, they link that back up. Do what? I said, I bet getting uh, hooter, uh, flying head scissors through some glass was painful. I bet you fucking so, because I got him in the back. Afterwards, Ooh. they link back up and start filling each other out. Meanwhile, Sicko is stabbing Jay with a rod that Sicko pulled out of his nose. So, little Sicko's like this little fucking rod, and he pulls it out of his He comes to the ring with it in his nose, and at some point, he pulls it out of his nose and starts stabbing Jay with it. And then he gets back in the camera and just puts it straight back through his nose like that. Oh, shit. Oh, damn. I don't know if it's like a tattoo needle or what, what it is, but it was like some sharp object. Jay goes to take control back over the match by breaking white tubes over Sicko's legs, but that didn't work too well. So Jay grabs a light tube, breaks it over Sicko, puts him up, and drops him. And goes for the pin. Sicko kicks out. Ooh. This match alone was a, a fucking bitch. They attack each other with a spike tube bat or swimming noodle or some shit. It was something. And then they start <laughs> picking the spikes out. So they're sitting over here attacking the, each other with this spike ball bat looking thing. And then afterwards they're sitting over here in each other's corner just... Picking these fucking spikes out of each other. Sicko oh, does man. a backbreaker, pins Jay, and making it 1-0. Ooh. So Sicko got the first pin? Yeah. Jay Blade grabs a bundle of tubes and drags Sicko up the hill and starts beating him in front of his fan. I don't know who this fan is. I'm not sure if it's his wife, his sister, his mom, or whatever. But Jay Blade gets out of the ring, grabs this bundle, and then drags Little Sicko off there and starts beating the shit out of the man in front of this person. A whole different fan. I'm not even for sure who this other fan is. But grabs, a, grabs the bundle of light tubes and breaks it over Jay's back. He goes the fuck off. Like, I don't know who this fan is, but they just hit Jay over the back with a bundle of light tubes. Oh, so, with that being said, Sicko capitalizes. They get on the ring apron behind them as four chairs on each side, so eight chairs all together, and two panes of glass. Jay goes back and puts Sicko through it. So, 
basically you got eight chairs and two panes of glass lined up perfectly and um jay blade he leans back a little sicko and just bam oh snap so, so then, now is it set up now is it set up with with four chairs in the glass and then four more chairs sitting on top of that glass then then more glass oh no it's straight four straight four and then pane of glass and a pane of glass Oh, so it's eight chairs on either side and two panes of glass in between them. Yeah, four chairs on each. Yeah, yeah, eight chairs on eight chairs on each side. Yeah, fucked them up. Hell. So Jay <laughs> chokes up. Like fuck somebody up. Jay chokes up sicko and a submission, making it one on one. But they're all over the place. They're in the ring, out of the ring, up and down the hill, over to the U haul. So, towards the end of the match, Sicko climbed on top of the U-Haul from the hood. I mean, you know, the hood of a U-Haul. Little Sicko just yeah, climbed yeah. on top of the motherfucker. Yeah. Jay says, fuck this shit. And climbs on the ladder. Jay and Little Sicko is on the U-Haul. Jay said, fuck it. He's not even going to climb. He's just going to use the ladder to get up there. He said, I'll get up there. I want to fuck every I get up there. So keep in <laughs> mind, this is the same U-Haul from the same spot that Bryant Woods to Little Sicko from the night before. It wasn't even 24 hours later. It was maybe like 12, less than that. And the murder scene blood looked like, like Brian White said, it's still there the next day. And this was like, like I said, maybe 12 hours. So Jay parrot bombs Little Sicko through the light tube on top of the U-Haul. Well, then Jay gets down off the U-Haul and grabs a bunch of light tubes. Meanwhile, Sicko is still in the U-Haul. Jay gets by the U-Haul, like beside of it, with the tubes. And Sicko does a crossbody onto Jay from the U-Haul. Sicko gets a pan and wins. So Sicko won that Ooh. round. Love that match between them two. If you have not checked it out, it is on uh, Total Match and Stream XPW. So be sure you go check it out. It is definitely worth it.